So what a lot of guys like to do, they'll take this cover plate off and then they'll, you know, obviously there's the, the, the screen that goes behind there. But what they'll do is they'll take a drill and they'll punch out a bunch of holes through here and there and here, whatever, cut that out. But without taking that inner baffle out, you're really not helping yourself out much. Stock muffler. So I'm gonna do two runs in this video. The one you're about to see here is with the stock muffler. Nothing else has been modified with the chainsaw. It's all factory. And the next one is gonna be modified. You'll see when we get there. Now let's get rid of that stock muffler and replace it with a properly modified one. Here it goes. Ah. There goes the screen and you can see it's clear. I'll take this guy off. After you get it off, what you have here is the muffler, and you can see it's got a baffle inside there. We're gonna turn it this way and look into the light. See, there's an internal baffle inside, just this box. It's pretty easy to get out. There it is, and if you have one of the older MS25 uh, mufflers, it's just a clamshell design. It's not sealed or welded, and all you gotta do is pull it off and it opens right up, but I've already taken the baffling out of this one. You can see where it used to sit right in there. Um, this one here, I have not, that's the one I just ran. I haven't opened it up yet. The easiest way to do that without grinding this off and welding it back, which is what I do, but the, the next easiest way to do it, take a Dremel with a carbide tip, cut out this corner from here to here, and then make a cut every three quarters of an inch or so, or like right here, and right here, cut this corner out from here to here, and then make, sorry for the shaky camera, make another cut right there, right there, and right there. Then what you can do, you take those pieces with a screwdriver, um, what do we got here? Take them with a screwdriver and then just pry them over, and that'll open up this clamshell. You can open it up and take out that baffle that's inside there. I wish I had one, and I'm not gonna take the time to open this one up right now. So that one there is the stock. This one here is modified. It's the old style clamshell that you can open up. And you can see I've already pried those open a little bit more than the stock one. So that's that stock. And this is pried open a little bit. But where all the magic happens is right here. If I can get the damn thing off one-handed. There you have it. You can see where the old screen was on there. And I just took took that Dremel and just augered that sucker out all the way around there. And you can see there is no baffle inside this one. There's, I left the two uh, rods that go through there. That helps guide, that helps guide the, um, your manifold studs. That helps them guide right through. Otherwise you gotta kind of fish them around and it's a pain in the ass. All right, so what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna take the modified muffler Throw it back in there. It's a good thing I've got those little guide rods in there. There we go. Right through there. Put these nuts back in. Okay. Here's your modified muffler. Going back in. Let's see how fast it goes.
Oh, shit.